I've had this camera for two months now and I am really digging it. It is the Canon M50 and I thought I would share with you as a beginner what the best studio settings are for your bedroom. So right now I'm running at 24 frames per second at 1080p. Uh, my shutter speed is 1 over 40 and I got a focal length of 3.5 and that's as low as it can go. I do have my ISO at 800. That might be a little high, but as you can see, I just think that this video still looks awesome. Um, I do have the autofocus on, it's that tracking autofocus, and I'm using a lavalier mic plugged into the camera. I'm just using it on auto, so I didn't switch it to manual, and I think it, for me, as a beginner, it just sounds fine. I did invest $5 on a blue light bulb that you see behind me to light up the back wall to kind of give it that, that cool look right there. But as far as anything else, I didn't buy any extra like soft boxes or any ceiling lighting or wall lighting. I found an old lamp for that blue light behind me. You can see it right there. It's just sitting on the floor. And if we look at my setup here, I just have my nightstand lamp right there that I put on top of my computer. And then I have a desk lamp right here. And that's really all I've been doing. Oh, and then I have the lighting from the monitors. That really helps. But what I wanted to show you is that with these manual settings, you don't have to spend a fortune in lighting to make your video look good. So if you're a vlogger and you're seriously considering upgrading from maybe your your Galaxy S10 Plus like I did, this might be the camera for you, between five to $600. So in conclusion for a beginner like me, going through these settings, it worked for me and I think the video just looks awesome and I just wanted to share it with you. If you found this content at all useful or helpful, please give me a thumbs up and please consider subscribing. And as always, I will see you in the next video.